I'm Lisa Pride for Roger Dean Stadium TV, and I'm here at the Florida State League All-Star Game in Dunedin, Florida, where both the Hammerheads and the Cardinals were well represented, and both the players and coaches felt honored to be called an All-Star. Your starting lineup for the snow. The batting third, the center fielder from the Jupiter Hammerhead, number 14, Isaac Galloway. It's an honor. Uh, I was hurt last year, or the past couple years, so it's my first All-Star game, so I'm pretty excited about it. To be thought of as, you know, one of the top guys in the league, you know, I can't really ask for anything more. Um, it's just really good to be part of a great group of talent and um, just get to experience something like this. You just gotta look at it as something fun. That's what it is. You know, this, this game is meant to meant to be like you know for fun for the fans, and that's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have that little competitor side for that one inning. But right when I'm done, I'm gonna go back to you know relaxing and enjoying the game. I just kind of go out there and try to do my best every night and uh, put everything out online every day. So you just kind of hope for the best, and when the best happens, things like this happen, and you get honored, and it's a it's a it's a great feeling. From the Palm Beach Gardener, number six, Ronnie Skaven. From the Jupiter Hammerhead, number five, Austin Barnes. That's a great experience, you know. Uh, being with all these great players and seeing what everybody's done over this uh, period of time and uh, you know, just being honored as one of the better players in the league thus far is, uh, is a great honor. Or Ryan Rieger. It makes it a lot easier, you know, especially with our coaching staff here. It's, you know, it's a little more relaxed. And plus when you have teammates, you know, we play with, we play with each other every day. It, you know, it's fun, it's comfortable, it, you know, it's exciting. Betting fifth for the Palm Beach Cardinals, the right fielder number 16, Steven Piscotti. Batting seventh for the Palm Beach Cardinals, the designated hitter number 23, Jonathan Rodriguez. I've been fortunate to be a part of a couple All-Star games, and um, you know you're happy for the players. You know you get to see people in a different light. You get to be in the same clubhouse as them, the same dugout versus you know across the field. So that's always a neat experience and uh, see the players talking and get to interact and things like that. So it's always a great experience. Thank you guys for coming out. It's a gorgeous day for some home run derby action, isn't it, here inside the Florida Auto Exchange Stadium? All right, guys, a round of applause from the Palm Beach Cardinals, Steven Piscotti. I was just trying to hit one. <laughs> Got lucky enough to hit a few, so uh, it's, it's a pretty cool feeling. It's a real blessing. Um, you know, he's, he's uh, played a lot of baseball. I've coached a lot with him, and it's really just fun to watch him go. I really enjoyed the home run derby, and glad to see him pound a few over the walls. <laughs> We listen to every game we can from California and we're, we're proud of him but we're blessed to have him and he knows that he's blessed with a talent. Pitching team for the South, known to pitch from the Jupiter Hammerhead, number 22, Justin Nicolino. It's nice to see that he uh, got awarded to uh, play in the All-Stars. It's nice to see that um, his working hard, he gets uh, recognized. Actually, a, a kind of dream come true. I, I kind of 
always dream of being an all-star in anywhere, pro ball, uh, big leagues. If I get there, you know, and actually getting the chance to hit a home run and, and help my team out, I should, it, was, it felt pretty good. And you get out there, you look around and you see everyone and uh, everyone's cheering, rooting, rooting you on and everything. So it was uh, really, really exhilarating and got your, uh, got your emotions going and stuff, but it was a good time. So the players provided the fireworks during the game as the South won 8-1, while after the game, the fans retreated to a fireworks display. What a perfect way to end the All-Star game. I'm Lisa Pride, and I'll see you at the Dean.